Here's the situation. You have given the students only one attempt on a quiz. For whatever reason, you wish to give the student a second attempt without deleting the first attempt. Plus, you would want the other attempt to be seen only by the student given the extra attempt. You should note, by using this solution, the quiz will disappear for all other students so they will not be able to see their submissions. It's a good idea that, one, that to open it up, open up the quiz for everyone after the individual student has taken his or her extra attempt. So what you need to do is click on the Submission Review tab on the nav bar, click on Quizzes. You want to click on the name of the quiz in which you wish to edit. Click the Assessment tab. You're going to scroll down and in the Attempts Allowed, you're going to change the Attempts Allowed. In this case, I'm going to give the student one extra attempt. They had one. I'm going to give them two. Click Apply. Click the Restrictions tab. Scroll down and click on the Add Users to Special Access. Now you should note that if you have, have, if you have an, an end time that has passed, you need to change that end time to a future date. If you don't have any dates, then just leave them alone. Scroll down and click the checkbox next to the name of the student you wish to give special access and give them this extra attempt. Click the Add User to Special Access. Now scroll down again and change and click the radio button next to allow only users with special access to see this quiz. Click save and close. You're going to see the restricted individuals icon will appear next to the quiz. This lets you know that only this one student can see the quiz. Again, all of the, the quiz disappears for all other students views. So now this one student can take the quiz and get their sec a second attempt. After the student has completed his or her attempt, you may want to open the quiz up again uh, for their submission. To do that, again, you click on the name of the quiz, you go to the Restrictions tab, you scroll down, change the radio button, and click the one that says Allow Users with Special Access to this quiz. Click on the X next to the special access that you have just given. Click Save and Close. And now when you look at the quiz, it will not have that restricted icon next to it.